Hello, audio people. It's Matt Miller here. Today, we're recording a hidden world of sound by converting electromagnetic radiation emitted by remote controls into audio. The electromagnetic radiation produced by a TV remote is not part of its function, but rather a byproduct of its circuitry. We can use an inductor coil pickup to convert electromagnetic radio waves into sound. The inductor coil picks up the voltages created by fluctuations of the magnetic fields emitted by the remotes. This electrical signal can then be recorded as audio. When you change channels, ramp up the volume, hit the menu button, etc., the remote sends out square wave signals of various frequencies, in pulses, dictated by the serial data being sent. For this demonstration, I'm using a commercially available pickup known as a telephone tap. These things have been around for a long time and were originally designed to record telephone conversations. They only cost a few bucks at your local Radio Shack or equivalent. You can also make your own inductor coil pickups by wrapping a length of copper wire around a tube or spool and connecting each end of the bare wire to an audio cable with your choice of jack. You can also harvest coils from old electronics like power supplies and relays. Just as with microphones, different coils will give you different results. Check the notes below for a link to a cool video by Leafcutter John showing how to make your own inductor coil and make use of existing ones. Keep in mind that inductor coils are by no means limited to recording remote controls. The audio you heard at the beginning of this video came from the electromagnetic radiation generated by a fluorescent desk lamp. Other things to investigate include modems, blinking LEDs, mobile phones, hard drives, servo motors, or an Opticon scalometer with a raptical extrusion. You get the idea. So I hope you give this technique a try. I've included a link to the sounds heard in this video in the notes below. They were recorded and edited at 24-bit 96K. Thanks, and see you next time.